on many VC pods today, one of the biggest topics of conversation is like, how defensible is this revenue? Yes, you're growing incredibly quickly, but can I project where you're going to be in two years the way I could have in 2018 had you had this growth rate? Do you think that's a real problem or is that kind of overstated? I, I think it's a pro- it can be a problem, especially for the companies where revenue grows really fast and kind of, de- again, it, it really is case by case. But yeah. if it's a lot of people who want to try something, then you might see revenue growing high, growing rapidly at the beginning. Yep. But are they going to continue with the, after they try it? Like how many like, of those people are going to try it? I think those are questions worth asking. Like, are they going to have other ideas that they need to create in the world? So the, the gating factor is like, how many ideas does this average person have? Or is it, yeah, I tried that, but it didn't. I have a ton of other ideas, but because this one, you know, I got lost in the step eight of 10 and I just never finished it. I'm not going to go back to that tool. Yeah, I think some people will try vibe coding and say it's not for them and just move on. Right. 